This is gonna hurt. Ouch! Ow! No, 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 no! Oh, snap! Yo, guys, it is Corrales. This is Game Dev Tycoon Episode 3. That's right. And we ended off Episode 2 right here. Which is the industry news about the Master Star V by Vena console. And to be honest, I'm not gonna use the consoles. I'm just gonna do PC games from now. At least for some time to come. Mm -hmm. That's right. So PC for the win. I'm, I'm gaming on PC. Why should I do PC games, right? Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, research, new topic. Should we do a s fantasy? Yeah, start research, buddy. Duck Hunt, come on, bring in those monies. <laughs> Duck Hunt is actually doing pretty good. We made some money. Although, I, I don't think I will be able to do my, my, my game engine still. Fantasy, perfecto, let's do a new game. You know what, let's go for World of Keralis. I know it's not that original, but it's cool. It's gonna be a fantasy game. It's gonna be like an adventure. No, it's gonna be RPG, you know? Fantasy RPG, perfect. Pick platform. Pace A, Pace A, and pick game engine. Keralis V1. 35k, next, perfect. Oh my god, come on. Can I afford this? I can afford this. I'm gonna do this. Hopefully, this will be the great success I'm waiting for. Uh, Gameplay. I'm no. I'm gonna bump up those to begin with. Linear story. Save game. You know what? I'm gonna go high tech on this. Yes. And you guys told me I could go negative 50k before I go bankrupt, which means it's cool. Dialogues. You know, level design a bit on artificial intelligence. Uh huh. That's right. I mean, I just want to have casual games. All right, it's cool, buddy. It's cool. I just want to have one great success. How amazing would that be? Mono sound. I'm gonna go big on this. That's right. Come on, bring in those points. You know what? This might actually do this. Just look, look at the po look at the design. This is my best-rated game ever at this point. <laughs> Industry news. Recent market data shows that Govedora G64 seems to be slowing loose market shares against other PC manufacturers. That's right, Gove. Gove. Come on. No, 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 no. I'm gonna finish this. That is my highest yet on design, right? I, I mean, I cross my fingers. This might be the big hit I'm waiting for. I'm just waiting for good reviews on this, baby. World of Keralis, the first game in the series. Uh-huh, come on, give me good reviews. Come on, come on, please. Eight. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Seven. What? Who are you to judge me? Hate him. Played it for days. Come on, loved it, all games. So 8788. Eight, eight. That is not bad. Look at the units being sold here. Oh my god, this is the big hit, guys. Look at the sales. Alright, so research. What should we do? Target audience? Maybe we should research that. Level editor. No. Target audience. That could be cool. That could be cool. Useful. Oh my god, look at this game! World of Corrales! That was a big hit! <laughs> According to our market research recently published game, World of Corrales is a surprised hit with the players. The developer Derp Game Studios is fairly new to the gaming industry, but we can't not wait until they develop the next thingy wing. Holy snap! Give me those monies! Alright, so we got target audience. Let me just see. Can we do level design as well? Just because we can't catch the game level, level editor. That's right. 
Today, Nintendo has announced they will introduce a portal gaming device called <laughs> Gameling. <laughs> that seems familiar. I've seen that before. I think I've had one like that back in the days. Yes, I did. It wasn't called Gameling though, but still, it's pretty amazing. I'm just gonna go PC all the way. Wolf Corrales, just look at this. Bringing in those cash. All right, so now we've researched, just researched the first engine part. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Look at the game history. Duck Hunt, boo. <laughs> Bot of <Phil> at <laughs> 21k. <laughs> Derp Space, kind of did good, right? But I mean, World of Keralis. That's right. Can I upgrade my engine? There we go. This is gonna be called Keralis V2. Are we ready for this, by the way? It's gonna cost 130 bucks, but it's gonna have a level editor, which is gonna be pretty... Nah, you know what? Let's go for more games. I'm not gonna go there yet. New topic, <laughs> Cyberpunk. What the hell is Cyberpunk? I don't know what Cyberpunk is even. <laughs> I have no idea. <gasps> oh my god. All right, you know what? Let's do casual games maybe. Nah, 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 nah. It is time for a new game. You can now specify your target audience. Picking the right audience for your game is important. Your target platform can be also rope. All right, all right, all right. So basically, young, everyone, mature. Young, everyone, mature. You know what? Why not just going to everyone? I mean, isn't that good? I'm gonna do, no. I'm gonna call it this game James Pond. That's right. It's gonna be... <laughs> we don't have really a good category to select. Military, maybe. I don't know. Action. Military action platform on the PC. Pick game engine. Kerala's V1. Mature audience. Bam, bada, beam, bada, boom, boom, boom. 35k to do that. Alright, so here, gameplay, story quest is like kinda important, you know? It's gonna it's still gonna. James Pond? I mean, come on, James Pond. I don't think this. Alright, so World of Corrales just got off the market. It sold 45,000 copies, generating a sales of 317,000 bucks in the pocket. Media Inquirer. Hello, I'm Steve O'Connell, a reporter for Planet GG. Okay. We have room for your company is developing a game for a mature audience. Give in to the view, buddy. I'm done with that. Mm -hmm. And that's gonna be a hype for James Pond, I guess. Dialogues, not that important in this artificial intelligence. That's gonna be the big hit. Uh huh. Come on, give me a hype on this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's right, hypey hype, hype up the game. The gambling, you know, I'm just trying to figure out if we should focus on the gambling or what. It's gonna be mono sounds, graphic wall design, and sound like, yeah, like that. Oh my god, the points are pretty good. Fix the bugs, give me some extra points. Can you give me more? Yes, come on, come on, you can do more. Yeah, that's right, that's right, just pop it in, pop it in, more, nah, finish it, alright, so let's see what James Pond can do on the market, I got 170,000 bucks in my pocket, which is, I don't know, I think it's pretty good, right, and I don't suck at this game, people write I, I suck it, this is like the third episode, I haven't played this game before, it's pretty hard, it's pretty complex, right, alright, open world and better AI, this is just getting more complex. Yeah, 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 I'm not gonna... No, no time to read. Marketing, yes, come on. First reviews of James Pond. I got a 10. Best of its kind. 9. Can't wait for the sequel. James Pond, 10. 10! So 10, 9, 10, 10, guys. I don't know. This 
is the big hit we've been waiting for. First World of Kiralis, now James Pond. Oh my god, first month we sold 53,000 units. Holy snapperoni. <laughs> I love this game. It's so simple, but yet so cool. I'm gonna research pub marketing, because if that's gonna give me the hype I'm waiting for, that's just gonna be bananas. When can we move out from this office? 100k units sold. And it's still going, just look at this. The latest game by Derp Game Studios has received very positive reviews overall. Star Games gave it 10, saying it best of its kind. Congratulations, you have made a quite a name for yourself and saved up a lot of capital. New office. Pay. Yes. I'm moving out. Derp Game Studios. Look at this. Thank you. You can now also train yourself and your staff to improve skills. All right. To get started, blah, 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 training menu. Fill position. We should maybe hire one. All right, all right, all right. Should we hire someone? That's the question. Straight away or what? You have to complete. All right, all right. Staff management training. What the hell is that? Staff list. We can do that. Where's the staff management training? Where do you, where the hell do I press to get the staff management training? Is there something I should research? Research or what? Where the hell is it? Can you guys see it? No. I mean, what the hell should I be doing here? I can't press anything. I don't know. I'm lost in the game. I'm just I'm just speechless. Look at James Pond going. 233k. Fill position. Simply click on your player character. Alright, alright, I'm sorry. I'm I'm sorry. I didn't read. <laughs> where is the where is the thing away? Where is it? Train, there we go. Staff management, start training. 1.5 million bucks. No, it just got off the market. It made 1.6 million dineras. I don't care about the. I'm go. I'm gonna go all in PC for this, guys. Mm-hmm. PC for the win. I don't wanna have. I don't wanna read that. Are we training? Can we fill position now? Great success. All right, so I can basically hire someone. Before you can hire someone, open position. Open position. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Um, I'm looking for. I'm gonna have a budget of 100k. That seems pretty pretty decent for the first run. And please, I'm gonna have showreel. That's right. Start looking. Did we find anyone? It seems that Derp Game Studios has recently moved into an office in a well-known technology park and it's now searching for employees. That's right. The company which is <laughs> which is known for games such as James Pond and World of Kiralis. <laughs> I got 2.6k fans just from James Pond and World of Kiralis. All right, so don't forget you can always train your employees. Yes, where's the employees? We get one which is called Alex White. His speed is 129. I don't know. Salary, 11k per month. Next person is Robin. He's a bit cheaper. How's the stats on this guy? This guy is much better. And cheaper. Why is this guy being so expensive? You know what? I'm gonna go for Robin. Robin Goodwin, buddy. You're hired. Yes, 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 yes. I'm gonna train him later on. Medium games. Robin is a girl, huh? I think I don't know. I don't fire. 
Stuff welcome training. <laughs> what is even that? Game design for pirates. Me make me think. Game dev games. Don't repeat yourself. Code incompleto. Hmm. Nah. You know what? I'm not. I have no idea what this is. I'm gonna do, go for some research. Casual games, medium games. What is what is medium games? Better AI. That is pretty important in games. I can't do that because I don't have enough research points. So it is time to do no oh generate by the way i am so confused now you know i am so confused and all in all of the moon just because of the great success music yep that's right i'm gonna go for music start research i'm gonna do like a rockstar game or something I'm gonna call it band camp or something just to get the game out. Vena Gear by Vena has been released. I'm gonna go PC, people. PC is the future of everything. Complete on music. That means develop new game and it's gonna be for everyone. Or nah, the young ones, to be honest. It's gonna be called Band Camp. There we go. Pick topic. Is it music? It's gonna be simulation pick platform pc did i just pick the g no pc come on although do young kids play on the pc that's the question yes they do hopefully they do i should just go with i should i should do a new new engine to be honest so story quests not important engine and gameplay that's right Just wondering where what is Robin doing? Dialogues not important. Level design and AI. Nah, level design. Oh my god, the points are so bad for this game. Just look at this. Sound muy importante. World design less. Graphic just a titty bit. It's gonna be totally sound. It's gonna be like a sound explosion. Points aren't that bad. Gonna fix some bugs. Go away. Come on, add some more points, please. Band camp. That's right. That's right. Come on, more. Keralis, you can do it. Technology. I can afford weight. Why are you creating bugs? Take away the bugs. Can we do anything else? Robin, do not do bugs. Finish. I don't think this is gonna be a big hit though. That's the problem. Or is it? Music simulation. Is that anything the kids want? James Pond for the win. I just say that. I'm gonna make a sequel in 3D as soon as I get the new engine up and running. Release game! Simple cutscenes, alright. This is so complex, this game. Come on. Pressy press. Um, reviews. Come on. Give it to me. Industry news. I don't want to hear anything about the Govador anymore. Nah, go away. All right. I don't think this is gonna be good. Six. Oh my god, this is gonna be bad. This is a bad game. Six, six, six. Pretty average, right? Five. This ain't gonna be a big hit, but I'm still gonna go and research. Let me see, what can we do? We can do a new game engine, or although, can we research anything to put in the new game engine? Game design, open world, that is, uh, that is, that is the future. So I'm gonna research that. What can you do? You can research stuff as well, right? So you're gonna research better AI. We can afford that, 15 RP points. Medium games. What the hell is medium games? You know what? Let's go for medium games. Robin, you can do it. <laughs> G64 is no longer supported. Go figure. What? This is a very special offer. Our agents have received very research information. We interest you. If you're interested in transfer. Uh uh. No way, Jose. That sounded fishy. Come on. Come on, 
come on. Open world publishing contracts. Uh huh. Oh, I see. A publisher will market and publish your game around the world. Mm-hmm, I see. Find publishing contract has been unlocked in action menu. Find publishing deals. Using a publisher is a great way to get your games in front of a large audience and transfer blah 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 blah. To use a publisher, you need to sign a contract. All right, come on, where is that all the text coming from? Pirate strategy. Any topic, game. Any topic, action. Penalty, penalty. You know what? I'm not gonna go for any contracts whatsoever at the moment. Create custom engine. So let me see. We can go into level editor and open world, which is gonna be Keralis V2. 160 bucks, K bucks, create the engine. And I think we can, can we hire, can we fill more positions? Ooh, I can hire four employees though, but no, 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 no. I can't afford that at the moment. <laughs> Bandcamp is doing so poorly. That was a bad combination, music and simulation. Guys, I'm gonna research the engine and we'll get back in part 4 ASAP tomorrow. It's now complete though. We're gonna make a new game, that's right. Oh, Bandcamp. What a nightmare. Although, look at this. James.